Hi Claire, I thought it'd be quicker to show you on the video of what I mean with, you know, CO2 proofing my overflow and, and all that. So, um, so there's nothing special about the overflow box itself. I think the only difference is, is that I made sure that the overflow pipes are sort of on the same level as the comb. So that there's very little sort of overflowing or waterfalling happening behind the... The, uh, the, uh, the comb of the overflow, if that makes sense. And in the sump, I shall show you now. Also, I don't know if you're familiar with the um, bean animal style overflow, which has the main pipe, that's the main sort of way for the water to go down. Any excess goes through the middle one here, and the third one is just an emergency one in case anything happens. So if you have a look at the sump, Again, the only real difference here is that uh, most of the water comes down this pipe, goes underwater and through this filter sock that's cable tied to the pipe. Just uh, This is actually what polishes my water. So again, there's very little water falling happens. Uh, the only water falling that really happens right now is any excess water that doesn't go down this pipe goes down this pipe and I can obviously sort of adjust it down here but I always have something overflowing down here which which does as you can see create some water falling but that's uh, that's a compromise I suppose so uh, so that's pretty much it good luck with converting yours take care have a new have a good New Year's bye